It appears we are almost ready to depart. It's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend on spell casting. I presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on. I have, Professor. Well, I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand wand. You'll be a force to be reckoned with when you get your own. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate you working with me before the term begins. Oh, <laughs> Eleazar! George! Glad my rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your finding us. I've apparated to oh, more gosh. vaguely defined destinations than this. <laughs> Though I confess I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some pit in the West End. <laughs> it's been much too long. When I received your owl, I must uh, say I... Best not speak here, <coughs> Of course. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? We have a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. Wonderful idea! As long as your young charge here doesn't mind me tagging along. Not at all, sir. After you. Ages since I've been to the castle. Would be good to see the old pile of rocks. I didn't get that. I didn't give this game much of a chance. So, I thought I'd come back to it. Traveling companion. A new student. New? Yes, sir. I'm starting school as a fifth year. How extraordinary. It is indeed. None of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late. Nor have I. Of course, as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now, the headmaster asked if I could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term begins. Well, you couldn't have asked for a better mentor. Professor Fig is not only an exceptional teacher, he's also a remarkably intuitive and gifted wizard. Mr. Osric is prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the Ministry. <laughs> have you seen this? I have. Opinions differ as to how great a threat Ranrock really is. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry, I believe he is a significant threat. And it was your wife, Eleazar, who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? How? <sighs> she wrote to me about Ranrock before she died, wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Before I could respond, I received this. It was the last thing she sent me, Eleazar. It came to me via her owl, but with no correspondence. I can only assume that she had to get rid of it quickly to keep it safe. Presumably from Ranrock. I cannot open it. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. It looks like goblin metal. That symbol. What's that glow? I don't see a glow. Nor do I. Merlin's beard! How did you- Wait! We did- Oh, hey! A dragon! I forgot that one. I forgot that's what happened. Oh, 
Okay, won't take a second. Wiganwell potion. That stuff will write you in a second. Okay, down to heal. Same as um the Star Wars type games that I've played. Right, what there's Fallen Order and then there's oh, George. I can't believe he What the hell got into that damn thing? Attacking a carriage midair? A typical dragon would never Professor? Sir, where are we? I'm not sure. But that key you discovered was clearly a port key. Port key? An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. Uh, I'm feeling better, sir, if you'd like to look around a bit. I would. But stay close. We've no idea who created this port key. Uh. Or why. I forgot all my buttons. <laughs> we didn't play this for long. Like a few, few hours? Three or four, maybe? I don't know. Wasn't long. Maybe even less, probably. How far did that port key take us? Farther from London than the carriage travelled. We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. So, those ruins. Do you think. The port key was meant to lead us there? I do. This has not been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that port key to George for a reason. And I believe that she, and now George, died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Let's see if we can find a path, however faded it may be. Okay. Mind your step. Jump is A, of course. Where do you suppose your wife got the port? Dodge. The port here? A good question. Miriam spent years searching for evidence of a long-forgotten form of ancient magic. Ancient magic? Yes. A powerful <laughs> magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time. Hogwarts Castle was built by, and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. I don't know where she came into possession of the port key, but I am certain it was to do with that search. Ah, there's the path down below. This way. I was going there. But sir, why was your wife searching for evidence of lost magic? Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world. Spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the one <laughs> who wields it. This is something. It's insane right here. Is that ice? It's not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that one work you were practicing. Focus on the center. Okay. Excellent. Huh. Good. Use camera. Uh, we're gonna fight some enemies. Way. That was a bit rougher than I'd expected. 
was a good view. Okay, so what I'm highlighting is just target was them, alright. So now? Your one word ah up there. Thank you, sir. <laughs> it seemed like all out of place. Huh. We're close now, it's just ahead. Alright. <laughs> Let's go back one day. <laughs> Repair. Okay. It's coming out of nowhere. Uh, it's magic. What are you gonna do? Almost there. <laughs> Why would someone do this here? I suspect they valued their privacy. That port key led us here for a reason. Let's have a look around for anything that seems out of place. This mini map, uh huh, yep. Uh. Professor, it's a mural of some kind. Mm. Perhaps our host was a noted seer. Interesting. Is that it? <laughs> Somewhere over there. Oh wait, hang on. Is it I'm looking at my mini map. Professor, uh, this statue This may have been his home. Hey there, pot. That enchanted crystallized stone again. But what could it be blocking? What's this? Professor Fig! Whoa. Oh, that's weird. How odd. Why would someone have conjured that enchanted stone here? And how is there a room behind it? What room? I don't see anything. There's that glow again, like the glow on the port key container. There's certain things I can see, okay. Just a moment. <laughs> oh, <clears throat> no way of here. <clears throat> Welcome to Gringotts Wizarding Bank. Vault number twelve, I presume. <clears throat> Precisely. 
the key. Hmm? Your wife's port key. Oh, yes, of course. This way, then. Stay close. After you. Inside the cars, if you don't wish to lose them. <laughs> I like to get my hands. <laughs> To the bank, common and Gringotts. They are most uncommon. Only one with great wealth or power, or both, could have arranged for such a service. The final one of the spin. A what? That waterfall washes away all enchantments. It's a security measure. Experienced the thief's downfall before, have you? Heard of it? These are the lower vaults that we're passing now. How deep are we going? Vault number 12 was commissioned shortly after Gringotts was founded over four centuries ago. It resides in the deepest part of the bank. Settle in. We've quite a distance to go. Okay. Number. Vault 12. Momentous day. <laughs> hmm. On your way. Okay, that does pause it. I'll be back, guys. Rare anyone goes there anymore. Here we are. I just assume that's that bad guy that we were. That was in the paper. I'm going to assume I can't remember her name. <laughs> When's the last time Already? this vault was accessed? A goblin has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years. In that time, no Jeez, one has visited Vault 12. Until today. Thank you for your help. Hey, this is not going to end well. Right. <laughs> what do you suppose we should be looking for? I'm not sure. Sir, I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Wait. Thank you, Mark. <sighs> Professor, Something that was I can certainly see. unexpected. Let me think. There must be something here. Hmm, Revelio, perhaps. Revelio? Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. Okay. Hmm. 
All right. Revelio. There, I saw something. Move a bit closer and try again. A door. Well, that's a start. There's that symbol again. I don't suppose you see a way to... I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw on the port key container. If what you can see reveals the way forward, then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. Just touch it, man. This is no ordinary vault. I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. What do you mean, earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I Rebellion. do. But to what end, I can't say. Stay close. Sounds there like a no scam, really. If things go poorly, not out of Kind of like survival sense in Dying Light. The Dying Light games. <laughs> I am constantly gonna <laughs> confess to that game, to those types of games, because I absolutely love, 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 love those games. I see something up ahead. What is it? That glow again, but on the floor. Rebellion. I know there's a parry encounter into this game as well, if I can remember. When I moved towards the glow, it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Yes, sir. Mm. I'm fine. Yeah, you seem to have caused the floor to change. That statue? What statue? I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Revelio, I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. It is. The reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Wait. When you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm. Perhaps you should uh, ah. Okay. Makes sense. Okay. Lumos. Well done. Now the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. I want to do this. There we go. Uh -huh. There we go. This is. Oh, so I have to do it. So, so why? So, same parry is like that angles. And I also like that. <laughs> I like that, um. I don't know, it's like a spider sense or something. Like that. <laughs> uh, it's the best I can reference that to. And he's good. Lumos. Professor! Professor Fig! Professor, where are you? This isn't good. Where am I supposed to go? What's happening? The wisps of magic seem to be leading me somewhere. Hmm. Yeah, I get it. There's a chest here. Gimme. Ooh, money. Rebellion. Anything else? Oh yeah. Ah, that's where they're ah, leading. That's the sprint. The glow again. 
chest is burnt. Give me the chest. More money. Rebellion. I suppose I'm on my own this time. Yep. Wait, I'm on the wrong one. Rebellion. Lumos. Ah, here we go. It seems I have no choice. I'm going to have to. F I need to align these statues with their reflections. Stupefied. Well. Stupefied. Ah, okay. So, like, quickly. Okay, it didn't work this time. So much easier when I'm not in a hard mode. <laughs> That's why I tried the first time. Yeah, okay. Take yep. Okay, okay, yep. Oh, hold. Treasure around Lumos. Ah, screw it. Rebellion. Yeah. Potato. Lumos. No. The press R key first. Floating above that basin. That is no mere basin. That is a pensive for viewing memories. I wonder. Follow my lead. Too well. I wonder if the path we've created may be impossible to follow. It will only be impossible for one who cannot see traces of ancient magic as I can. Your ability to see what others cannot will not be enough, Percival. We are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets, with knowledge others will do 
anything to obtain. Yes, and if we are correct, Charles, the witch or wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge and the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all that we can. That's what you're seeing. The glow that surrounded them. Yes, sir. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed, but could never. Miriam, and perhaps George, died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And you, it seems, are the key to understanding why. We were... It all looks rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. Who were they? I don't know. But, sir, you shouldn't be in here. I was right. Ranrock. Seems That's my a... reputation precedes me. I was beginning to think no one was ever going to visit Rackham's vault. And why are you here? No need for that. Just give me whatever it is you found here and we can let bygones be bygones. <coughs> uh, sir, they had the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I... I only meant that the instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist. I was to grant access only to one with the key, and you did terrible. I have no patience for traitors. Now... Where were we? I'm not giving you anything. Hmm. Well, perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful. No, 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 boy. Should I say? <laughs> I've been playing a lot of God of War in my spare time. Fine, sir. I've never seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. Where are we? <laughs> it can't be. It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to.
this I got this game like about run about around the time I this game came out. I was a bit of trouble getting it though. <laughs> uh because I don't know who um uh I was uh, asking for it around. Oh, good. We haven't missed the sort of said it wasn't out yet, but it was but it wasn't I'm for no expert, but the Xbox that One. Seems more appropriate. Now I need to study this locket as soon as I can, but first I must contact uh, the minister. Can't remember how I ended up They need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock. For the moment, I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. Of course, sir. Thank you. Ready for the sorting ceremony? Jealous. Black. Prepare yourself to meet the headmaster. Fig, nice of you to join us. The sorting ceremony is over. There were complications. Complications? It seems the goblin problem. I've no time for rumors, Fig, and I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. <clears throat> I'll be in touch. <laughs> Professor Weasley, we've one more to be sorted. Welcome. You're just in time. Have a seat. Ah, yes. A bit older than the others, aren't you? You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. Uh, I'm looking like forward tomorrow. to exploring Hogwarts and the world beyond the castle and grounds. Mm, indeed. Much can be gleaned by having an adventurous spirit. But your professors have a great deal to teach you as well. Mm. I wonder... Mm. I detect something in you. A certain sense of... Mm. What is it? <laughs> uh, I don't know. Either one. <laughs> A yes. desire to learn? I do enjoy a good puzzle, and I believe I have a ready mind. Mm. Mm, really. You're clever indeed. You have the ability to reflect clearly on that which puzzles others. And you've a ready mind. <coughs> Quick to learn. Perhaps you belong in Ravenclaw. Ravenclaw, okay. I don't. What did he get last time? Ah. You belong in here. Ravenclaw. And one more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. Enough 
It's not as though I've banned flying altogether. But don't tempt me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said, I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. Quite an entrance. It's lovely to meet you. I'm... Professor Weasley, would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As Deputy Headmistress, it is my distinct honor to show you to your common room. Right this way. <coughs> it's quite uncommon for a student to begin as a fifth year. Might be a bit of a challenge, but one I'm sure you're up for. I am, Professor. This is the entrance to the Ravenclaw common room. You must solve a riddle to enter. I won't be of much help, I'm afraid. This sort of thing has always confounded me. Oh, great. Who lived long ago? Because of what isn't it? The ghost? Or the oh, I hate puzzles. A ghost or a poltergeist? Hmm. A non-being can never have been. Okay, I can just hang out to the Well though. done. Now, go on in and get some sleep. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your I first I don't think class. I got this last Thank time. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first yeah, night I think we got assigned to a different sleep house. Well. Thing, whatever. I don't know. What do you call it? I don't know. <laughs> I definitely didn't get into the... Wait, Gale Claw? Was it? Or something? I don't know. What? I already forget the name. <laughs> Bad memory, gosh, yeah. Couldn't tell. Looks like everyone's gone. Better head to the common room. Did I get lost in what the what the look? I suppose I have to wait for the right moment. Okay, sorry about that. Press One X. moment. Watch this. Ugh. What is this? It's someone for a dumb box. <coughs> <coughs> Let's get out of here. Mm. That wasn't quite the reaction I wanted. Oh well. Right. What did you hope would happen? I suppose I hoped it would lighten. No, I didn't get into this. Ravenclaw last time. can be a bit on edge the first day of class. Ravenclaw. I'm Game Everett, by the way. You seem to be right calm next to some of these characters. <laughs> and you survived a rather harrowing trip here. I'm glad to be here. Ready for classes to start. Good. Glad to hear it. Truly, there's no reason to be nervous. Most professors are firm, but fair. I mean, not all of the tricks I play are as simple as a tossed dung bomb. And I'm still here. Wait. Did you say most professors are fun but fair? Ha! <laughs> I did. But probably best I let you judge for yourself. No, I didn't get this I didn't tend to push their after. limits. I should wander off before someone traces that dung bong back to me. Nice meeting you. You too, Everett. Yeah, I definitely didn't get into this last time. No, that's not right either. How the heck did I grab that apple? <laughs> We're back. Okay. Hmm. That's not right either. <laughs> um, yeah, that's... I just grabbed the apple from no... Okay, that make... doesn't make any sense. I want him to be in the perfect place. A place he'll be happy with. But I can't seem to find it. Great golden gobstones. I want him to thrive here. Golden gobstones? <laughs> My own little expression. 
I bought this Dittany seedling from home and I so want him to feel cozy. Dittany is amazing, isn't it? So much healing power in such a little plant. <laughs> I'm a bit of a thing for plants, as you can see. <laughs> Pleased to meet you. I'm Samantha. Nice to meet you, Samantha. You, 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 you. Is Dittany used in Wiganwell potion? It is. Looks like someone's been studying up on their potion making. Actually, Professor Fig told me about the Wiganwell potion. Of course. Mm. I heard you were studying with him before term. He's an enigma, Fig. Teaches about theory. It seems to know a lot about practical magic. Professor Fig does know a great deal about, um, different forms of magic. Well, I hope he told you about more than Wiganweld. You've lots to catch up on, I'm sure. Yeah, can I, um, it was nice like, to meet you, crack my own... Good luck with your ditany. Yeah, Wigan Thank you. Potions. And good luck to you, too, on your first day. Oh, I don't know. Time to grab this apple somehow. <laughs> Whatever you want to I grab the apple. That's that just no brilliant, sense. Amit. Brilliant. You think you could? Ah, why hello? Would you like to take a look? Can't see too much in the day. Well, except for stars like Sirius, Canopus, Vega, and Arcturus. I'm Amit. Pleasure to have you in Ravenclaw. Never met someone who's been so close to a dragon before. Can't say I'd recommend it, frankly. It's nice to meet <laughs> you, Amit. I take it you like astronomy. Oh, yes. So much to be learned from the stars. Also, there's something about the open air and night sky above the tower. It's invigorating. You will adore astronomy. Professor Shaw is incredibly knowledgeable. I hope astronomy's on my schedule. Sounds interesting. I have good news for you. You are most definitely taking astronomy. It is required for all fifth years. You will be enthralled with the tower. Plus, a quality <laughs> telescope can show you things you never dreamed of. I suppose I'll see you in class then. Yes. Oh, and speaking of class, better get to my first one of the year. Nothing like the smell of fresh parchment, is there? Be seeing you. Hey there. Mm -hmm. Hello. Hello. Professor Weasley is looking for you just outside. You would best not keep her waiting. <laughs> okay. What? Ah. You go down. Confusing. Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts? I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your <laughs> unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls. Owls. Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have oh, when you leave here. Hate. After much discussion with the headmaster <laughs> and the like of magical so. education at the ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. Here you are. Uh, I'm looking out nowhere. <laughs> What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. Put in my magic pocket. Thank you, Professor, but <laughs> what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to okay. the test. So I can track her for collectibles I'm going to assume. Right? This way. The guide will give you opportunities to practice Whoops. your magic and educate yourself about wizarding law.
I could just do that anytime, apparently. I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Mm -hmm. Why don't you cast Revelio on this bust and see what details the field guide can provide? <laughs> Revelio. Hmm. Okay. Okay, XP, levels, challenges, yeah, inventory, everything, collectibles. <laughs> mm -hmm. I don't really care. Clever, isn't it? Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like that. Rebellion. Inside and outside of the castle. Is that like. It's like. Uh, I like the way I explain it. Uh, Oh. Okay. No time oh, to you were sprinting down the stairs before. What's that do? Oh. Oh, yeah. You got all of this. Yeah. <laughs> Rebellion. Why is that like ping noise? Oh, it's over here. It's a gold and I want it. Ah! <laughs> Wait, no. Yeah, you got 15 seconds. What's this? Just, gimme. <laughs> What's this? Roll. Oh. Puzzle! Ugh! Okay, so we got a bunch of this stuff. Alright, whatever. Um, we'll do something with that later. Alright, that pauses the game as well. Okay, good to know. Ah, good timing. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use blue flames to get around a bit quicker. Your field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. <laughs> Wrong button. Alright, yeah. What? Alright. Ah. And here we are, quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. I can never get enough of the castle. You can Rebellion. get anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. Oh, there's something over there somewhere. Uh -huh. But I do it, I don't know. Something. Always something happening here. It's the heart of the hive. Our King's Cross Station, okay. so to speak. Okay, so it's basically... That should be uh, all for now. You'll be expected yeah. to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day, and you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. 
I'm sorry, Professor, but I'm afraid that's all there is to it. Hmm. Almost precisely what Professor Fig said. Speak of the devil, Professor Fig. Mm. Your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfectly good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very well. Enough chit-chat. I need to get to class myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank you. <clears throat> Good luck today. And remember to use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you. And invaluable to me, as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you masterfully evade Professor Weasley's interrogation regarding our late arrival? I did my best, but I'm fairly certain she suspects that we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well-trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guide's map? Unfold it and have a look. Okay, yeah, I'm trying. Okay, main quests. Okay, yeah. Uh, yeah, level... Yeah. Arms class, Accio. I don't know if you don't want really. I'll do them both eventually. The map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead, what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach yeah, I out when I have more information about our oh, mysterious rocket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. I don't know what that ding means. Oh, here. Okay. This way. What does that mean? I don't know. Let's see if I can jump off. <laughs> Rebellion. Uh, 
heck is this mirror? What happens with it? Butterfly. Butterfly mirror. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Rebellion. Oh, yes. Hmm. I don't know. <laughs> Run up those stairs. Run to the wall. Perfect. Some of us don't necessarily you must be mid And then the werewolves join the goblins, goblins in the uprising. Werewolves, where were you? In the goblin rebellion of 1752. And by the end of it, the Minister for Magic what? was Albert Boot. No, it wasn't. <gasps> oh, what fun! I won't <clears> say <throat> my goodbyes. I shall cheer for the boy who says you're telling I'm lies. I'm not telling lies, Peeves. It was Albert <sighs> Boot. No, it wasn't. What? It was Basil Flack. Ooh, fight, fight! It's a bold attack! Mm, it was the Minister works. of Boot or the Minister of Flack. Stop it, Peeves. You'll get us in trouble. In trouble you will be, but you can't get Peeves a smack. She says it's a boot and he says it's a flack. Peeves, mm, that enough! Works. You'll get us all detention. Oh, and you're both wrong anyway. It was Hephaestus Gore. It wasn't Boots and it wasn't Black, but you're all in trouble with Professor Black. <laughs> okay, there must be something. <laughs> oh. What? Where's this meant to be anyway? <laughs> Rebellion might just be <gasps> cat. <laughs> yeah, I could put the cat. <laughs> Lock level one. I don't even know how that would work. I don't, I don't know. What the heck? Rebellion. Thank you, book. Can I shoot the book? The book on. Darn it. There's another cat. Wait for it to come around. It's like the <laughs> the Odin Raven. Oh, come on. Come on. Becky, you don't book. Yeah, that's actually a lot easier uh, to get from here. Mind what you're doing there. Uh, perhaps you should mind your own business? <laughs> I'm back here. You don't book. Yeah, I don't even know how to catch the book. Oh, well, whatever. Oh, maybe when I get okay. here. Behind you. There is an open seat here. Thank you. Hello, I am Nettie. So you are the new student. Have you met Professor Ronan yet? <coughs> Shall we begin? No, I have. <laughs> Welcome to year five of charms. Now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work, but I am confident that we will take hold with a passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Right now, everyone, please open your textbooks to page 517. But before we begin, can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the color change and growth charms? Anyone? Anyone? Hmm? Ah, 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 ah. 
I am afraid it is too late to study now. Hmm. My, the summer months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays practicing obliviate on one another. <laughs> uh, hmm. Do you even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm? Hmm? Hmm. Well, it seems that we are in dire need of review. Everyone get into pairs and take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are, and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only one book will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. That is not bad. You are a swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, potential is nothing without practice. Keep at it. <laughs> you might just rival Miss Onai here. Very good, everyone. That's enough of that. Well, as you all seem to have the basics down, and it is an exceptionally lovely day, I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. After me! Alright. Why do I need my enemies? Ah, okay. I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree. Hmm? <laughs> So, what better than a bit of sport to put our prowess with the summoning charm to the test, right? <laughs> oh, yeah, this thing. <laughs> so, why don't we have our newest students start us off? Hmm? Huh? 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 Very simply, cast Accio on one of the spheres and Accio your charm at the last post. Splendid! Now, yeah. uh, think of this like gobstones, if you will. But instead of throwing the marbles out, you are summoning them towards you. Very good! Ah. Excellent control there. Don't lose your composure. Very good. Points to Ravenclaw. But there's certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. Miss Onai, would you care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? Come on up. You'll be the blues, just as before. And Miss Onai, you are playing red. Clear? Yes, sir. All right. That is how it's done. Okay. Akio. Splendid. Watch this. Jeez. Ah. A hmm. perfect score. Hmm. Remarkable. Hey. Oh, I wanted to do something.
One second. Interesting, shall we? <laughs> oh. I think we are well past interesting at this point. I'll say. Hey, enough chatter. Focus now. You will need it. This round settles it all. Here we go! Turn it. That's it. Missile. Oh, right. That is how it's done. Ah, brilliant. That's annoying. I'm gonna give up points this time. Okay, I wanna wait. There we go. No! No! Turn it. Very good, both of you. Well done. Ugh. Oh, come on. What's that one? Class is dismissed. The other things on the way up. Well done back there. You took the loss in stride. Didn't want to go too easy on you. Took me weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. That's good to hear. It's a lot to take in all at once. <laughs> to put it lightly, I remember how I felt when I first arrived. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. My mother received an offer to teach divination here. Before I knew it, we had left Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. Well, it's been nice talking and competing with you. And with mm. you. Ah, I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. Better not keep him waiting. Until next time. Of course, uh. you can use Akio. A word, if you would. If you're so inclined. Yeah. You wanted Professor. to speak with me, Professor? I did. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation? Well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? Miss Onai is a talented witch. Take it in stride. One often gains the most from the battles one has lost. Of course, Professor. It was a challenging match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor. Though I sense that she is a bit distracted of late. <clears throat> now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Expect to hear from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for you. Oh, that's special. <laughs> Hello? Alright, now I should really get this. Level up plus 15 HP. Nice. Accio. Give me that. Maintains them. With the help yeah. of house elves, obviously. <laughs> I got a couple of cats. Oh, I got a couple of cats. Revelio. My little brother sent me that. Nothing. Uh -huh. I don't get it with that. What? I don't even know what I'm doing with this. Reveal. What? What even is this? Um. 
Um, I don't know. What does even the symbol mean, anyways? Okay. Surely it won't be that again. <laughs> I'll just go through everything I can. <laughs> First time to see, try, try again. Even <laughs> uh, gear. Oh, yeah. <laughs> What's your offense? Nice. for me <laughs> oh. apparently that was the second option and whatever 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 um level one lock okay I don't know what I'm gonna do with that <laughs> really there's something up I can go up. Is that like a puzzle or something? Hmm. I'm just curious at this point. Revelio. There. What am I seeing? No idea. I gotta tell her if you like. Rebellion. Okay. Something here. Hooray. <laughs> Something I don't know. Is that... Is this like a ding? I don't know why. Ah. Unbreakable pot. Right up here. Revelio. Ooh, that's treasure up there. <laughs> Yoink! Ooh! Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I need a hat? No, I don't want a hat. Ooh, 
Ooh, legendary. No trait applied. Two more offense, though. It's a scarf. <laughs> I don't know why a scarf gives me... Whatever. Yeah, legendary piece, though. Sweet. Okay. It's exploring something a lot. Revelio. Okay, what is that? I don't know what that dig means. Ooh. Man, I wanna fly. I've seen like a little chart clip of some people flying in this game. Where's the thing coming from? Huh. Hmm. Alright, well clearly this is not where I'm meant to be. Yeah. Crack. Oh, waypoint it. I found a legendary piece of gear. Thank you. I can apply traits and upgrades where. Dang. Uh, I do like me some um, RPG games. Again. There's that again. I don't know what the digging means. Ooh. Some places with a chest. Chest! Whoa. I don't feel like an eye on it. I get like a thing that like has like lower oh, church. That's that's a parry. Hmm. Bones. Ah, what else could I have expected? Rebellion. Look at something else. I don't know. There's something else below. Wait, there's something else below. I wanna see what that is. A treasure. Ah, level one lock. Okay, I'm assuming I can get lock picking at one point. I got this legendary scarf. <laughs> enough to blast each other to pieces on your own time. I get new students hmm. every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. To the wise, age matters very little. Today we will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Levioso. Levioso? A levitation charm? Levioso! A surprise uh. opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? One thing I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity. Especially in the heat of battle. Now, let's practice what we've just learned. Starting with something small. Okay. Perfect. 
Levioso. Now, let's try something a little larger. Let us begin yeah, with the audience. basic cast. See how the dummy deflected your cast. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. Remember, a surprise. Levioso. Now, well done. Very good. I have blocked but by a dummy. The best way to practice is by dueling. We'll start with you two. Duelist, take okay, your Okay, so yellow. Sorry for a proper Hogwarts welcome. Now, <laughs> I want a fair duel using only Levioso, basic cast, and Protego. You may begin. Okay. This should be easy. Levioso. <laughs> lucky. Nothing lucky about it. Good form. I know. Ah, what it. are you doing up there? You're good, Protego. Protego, perceptive. Thank you. Levioso. Class, I hope you were paying attention. That is how you are happy with Levioso. Let's just say I'm... I do enjoy life. Levioso. Use the basic cost when your opponent's guard is down. <laughs> Not bad for a beginner. You give as good as you get. <laughs> <laughs> I put you on the spot, and you rose to the challenge. Points to Ravenclaw. Thank you, Professor Hackett. Glad to have the opportunity to practice. <laughs> if what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. I this is Hogwarts Legacy, not from my students. World. They are capable <laughs> of achieving it, <sighs> and they must achieve it. A classroom duel is one thing, but battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelows entirely. Understood, Professor. So, I'd advise you to yeah, keep practicing I'm... whenever you can. <laughs> Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again. Well yeah. done today. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. Oh, All right. Key. That's enough spectacle for one day. <laughs> Class is dismissed. Nice work. I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Practice? It felt more like I was dueling an expert. Sebastian Sallow, by the way. I didn't expect a new student to be so deft with a wand. Then again, perhaps this wasn't too first sense. duel. <laughs> uh, Let's see. I've dueled enough. Consider yourself lucky I held back. Huh, fair enough. You owe me an honest duel when you aren't. You know, you might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned dueling organization. Exclusive and unsanctioned. Count me in. Excellent. Knew I was right about you. If you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to break the rules now and then. Whether it's joining a secret dueling club, or sneaking into the restricted section of the library, you just have to be clever enough not to get caught. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll keep that in mind. Good. Pleasure chatting with you. I'm sure I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? We'll see if your performance today was sheer luck or actual skill. Look for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. Gotta yeah, keep in mind, gotta look above my head. <laughs> Till next time. There's a thing in Ah, so close. If I find more collectibles, I could probably do things. I'm gonna get out. Oh, no. It's down. Oh, up. Oh. <laughs> I 
Anything? I wish those okay, but blue's like puzzles and stuff. Ah, this should love me up. Definitely. Or not. Okay. Wow. Outside. I have a map. Uh, yeah. I don't have anything over there. Oh, I'm on a track. Let's just get on with the thing so we can get out exploring. Yeah, I get something to make me, like, somewhat invisible. On about. Revelio. Something downstairs. I How do I go to go down? I'm curious. Go down over here. Oh. And this is where they put me. Oh, two lock. Revelio. Ah, that should definitely let me up. Uh -huh, Twenty HP. I'll take it. I want to go down. Where would I go? I really want to find that ch chest because then I get more s stuff. More stuff. <laughs> uh, get what that awful puff girl said in 1421. What lovely style. Oh, that's class, that is. There's something down. I don't like there's any staircases down. Here at least. Wait, isn't it? Yeah, this is where I get like repair. Okay. Well, 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 where I use it at least. See something down? How the heck do I get down? In here. Look oh, Unlock the fast travel. One lock. Oh. Maybe that's where? Oh, that's how I get that one. Oh, that sucks. Oh, this is where I get repair. Cause I know I need to do that because the stuff gets broken in some, the village. Yeah. What about the room, Professor? I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. Oh, excuse, Deke. Ah, there you are. I trust your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Hecate and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit before you arrived. I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me, isn't there? Have you and Professor Fig not discussed my training? He continues to be reticent about the details. Mentioning only a few spells. Revelio, was it? And Lumos? That's correct, Professor. I see. Like trying to get a sonnet from a streeler. Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. Professor Ronan did mention something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first one. Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier, we've arranged to replace yeah, the supplies lost on your way here, sort of including seeds, potion oh, yeah. recipes, and spellcrafts. Thank you, Professor. 
And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. You've managed your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Perhaps Sebastian Sallow or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. <clears throat> I'd like to go with Sebastian. Glad to hear it. Mr. Sallow is a capable mm. young wizard. And he knows the area. He'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavory local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle doors. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the Three Broomsticks. I just want to explore. Ah. It's a lot. Revelio. Ooh, chest. What? Okay. There's another chest over there. I want it. I want it. <laughs> How do I get in there? I need to get the lock. I need lock level one. Ah. Cat. Ah, there you are. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed I do, and an exceedingly useful one at that. The mending charm, Reparo. Fixes things right up, makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. Hmm. It seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well, but first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have arranged some for today. See them through and then report back to me. <laughs> we will have you casting Rapero in no time. I'll start on the task right away, Professor. This is the right area. I wonder where the flying page is. Hmm. Here it. Oh. Ah. Hey, come here. Okay. Got it. The right flying there. page must be around here somewhere. Bring it. Come here. I trust the preliminary. I completed the assignments, Professor. Marvelous. You clearly know your way around basic charms. Let us give the old mending charm a try then, shall we? Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now. Wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Remember, your wand is a conduit of your magic. Okay. That's that it. A. Very good. If you would like to practice mending something, have Prepare. a look that broken statue in the alcove by the water. It allegedly symbolized heartbreak. Perhaps a jilted lover thought it too accurate and lashed out. That's yours, right? Or not. 
Repair. Okay, that does not work. Clearly. Repair. Unit. Perfect. Okay. I don't suppose I can use this. No? Boo. <laughs> okay, ancient magic, ancient magic throw. to do this. So you got like these different types of symbols. I don't even know what they mean. Okay, so none of them go with that one. Go with the horse. I'm gonna go with the horse. I'm gonna try on there, really. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Glasses. Oh, more defense. Destroy. <laughs> All right. All right. Apparently, it was the second option in the spider. Apparently. Rebellion. Sorry. I saw that. Oh, I saw that. So it was not down. Confusing. Okay, whatever. I'm already a bunch more stronger than I was. Repairer. Nothing. This cannot possibly be as difficult as it seems. Hello. I, I don't believe we've met. Oh, hello. I'm Lenora. Pardon me if I'm <coughs> little distracted at the moment. Everyone thinks I'm utterly balmy. Samantha thinks I'm potty. But it's this painting. I never noticed it before. If I know Hogwarts, and I do, an empty frame doesn't appear for no reason. Something more to this. If I have the time, I may look. Could be intriguing. I've been racking my brains long enough. 
I hope you'll have better luck than I have. Revelio. Do come and find me if you stumble on something illuminating that solves the mystery. Lumos. Ah, illuminating. That spot must be a clue. I should look around in case it's nearby. Revelio. Okay, so some stairs. Ah, oh, telling me. Ah! Okay. This Here's looks like the location paint. from the painting. What could be so special about it? Ah, guided with Let's the light, get you yeah. Back to frame, Mr. Moth. Ah! Revenge. Ha! I knew there was a connection. I should tell Lenora that I solved the puzzle of that empty frame. Okay. So I find more of those to do that. Then in the end, it didn't huh. shrink. What didn't shrink? There's nothing over here. But I'm wrong. Lenora! I solved the mystery of that painting. You did? How? I found the location depicted in the painting, and then I cast Lumos to guide a moth back to the frame. All very logical, I suppose. A pity I was so close to solving it. You have a knack for solving riddles. Natty's good at that too. So is Meat, although he does tend to over-explain. Well, I'm glad someone figured it out. The moth. Okay. I should have seen that. Rebellion. Ah, oh, there's a ton of EXP, darn it. Huh? Here? No, there's no, like, ringing. Oh, no, there is. I'm confused. Where did it even go? Revelio. Like, because it sounds like it's over here somewhere. Is there no fall damage? I don't know. Oh. Revelio. down ah uh, but not the way I need to go Darn. rebellion Yet. Oh. Oh. Secret. <laughs> There's a war, apparently. Oh, yeah. Superb. Ah. Huh. So the, I found like a better rarity. Hmm. Rebellion. Yeah, nothing. 
You appear out of nowhere. Fancy meeting you here. Locked. Hello, Sebastian. Ah, my new charge. I'm told you're in dire need of supplies, and I'm to accompany you into Hogsmeade for ah. Is this your first? Oh, should I wish I could change my choice. It is. I haven't left the castle since I arrived. Well, I shall endeavor to be the very <sighs> best of guides then. Hogsmeade's a charming little place, self contained, too. We should be able to find you everything that you need. Shall we? Mm. Should have picked a different choice. Ugh. <laughs> I was glad you easily asked me to join you today. As am I. Thank you, by the way. Of course. You're the only one who's ever bested me in a duel. The way I see it, I'd be wise to keep an eye on you. <laughs> I don't hear any dinging. What's Speaking of dinging Weasley, me? she seems to have taken quite a shine to you. Has she? That's nice to hear. I'm still surprised that a professor would entrust me with anything, given my detention record. Revelio! Spend a lot of time in detention, do you? Just enough to keep me well rounded. <sighs> no, there's nothing. Speaking of detention, this trip to Hogsmeade might have saved me from one. Oops. Glad I could be of service. Madam Scribner, the librarian, was on the hunt for me, as is often the case. Professor Weasley came to retrieve me, and I was able to convince old Scribner that I had somewhere to be. Yeah. So how did you manage to get on the librarian's bad side? <laughs> well, I suspect it's a matter of differing opinions. She thinks I shouldn't be allowed in the restricted section, and I, on the other hand, am inclined to disagree. Oh, just one moment. This is an excellent spot to gather lacewing flies. They're pretty to look at. If you stew them long enough, they make a powerful potion ingredient. Quiet. <laughs> okay, so, like, yeah. Revelio. Merlin's beard from the Forbidden Forest. Look. What's going on? See for yourself. Quite a sight, isn't it? You certainly don't see that every day. Mm. Can't sprint anywhere. Hmm. Mushrooms. He's already seen the hippogriff. Likely already named okay. him too. Prance Hoof and Sugarfoot. Revelio. Oh. To the left is the Forbidden Forest. Did not mean anything. Out of bounds to all students. Oh, hence the name. Precisely. They think it's too dangerous. I think they need to have more confidence in our defensive abilities. Ah, 
You can see Hogsby just past those ruins up ahead. Nothing. <laughs> uh, something down there I want. <laughs> Have you had much of a chance to explore? Accio. A little? It's positively enormous. Ah! It is that. I've got five years and barely scratched the surface. Moonstone. Discover. Oh? Any you'd like to share with the class? Perhaps one oh. day. I can't go around telling you all my secrets now, can I? You still haven't told me how you became so good at dueling. Oh. Sorry, I fell. Game. I'm sorry. Game. I'm sorry. Ah, no. Game, I'm sorry. Game, I'm sorry. Oh. Wait a minute. Rebellion. <laughs> I fell. Game. Break. <laughs> I need tons of these mushrooms now. Accio. No. This isn't gonna work. Just. Revelio. Anything else from the scene that looks at it? Except for this bag. Ah, finding a ton of good stuff. <laughs> Level six. Nice. Oh. This is better already. Fine. I have more attack. Revelio. Revelio. Accio. Ah. Can we do it? Revelio. A little bit of a little bit of now. <laughs> I'm assuming I can make potions out of this. I've always thought Thestrals pulling a carriage a bit grim. Though I suppose most people don't actually see them at all. But you can see them. Unfortunately. But you've seen quite a bit yourself firsthand too. Most notably that dragon attack. Hopefully the rest of your year isn't as eventful. Revelio. Okay, well I want these mushrooms. Maybe let me collect them. Gimme. 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 <laughs> oh, it's not down there, but I won't, be, I won't be able to get those ones. Rebellion. One of the good resources are in. Mr. Moon! He's the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Hello, Mr. Moon. Oh, my Pleasure. Uh, you might want to turn back, Mr. Sallow. Uh, turn and run. Is everything all right, sir? Oh, it looked right at me. Eyes big as saucers. What did, Mr. Moon? Demi guys. Ugly and airy. Terrifying. <laughs> I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. Demi guys. Huh? I don't know Revelio. what I've this pumpkin juice, and he's obviously had too much of it. I've never seen <laughs> Mr. Moon in such a state. Accio. Mr. Moon. 
Mr. Moon is quite the character. Revelio. My sister Anne thinks he's lovely, but I'd say he could improve a bit as a caretaker. Oh, is your sister in Slytherin too? She is, or rather, she was. She's not well at the moment, but she'll be better soon and back at Hogwarts. Okay, this means something to buy. Like one of those things. Okay. Honestly, so there's something one head there. the magic of this place. Chest. I don't chest, know if it's chest, the shops chest, or the people. Chest. 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 We all mm. flock to it like moths to a flame. Chest, 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 chest. Let me move. Chest. Chest. This. Oh. Rebellion. Ah, oh, the chest is inside the building. Oh. Don't mind if I just take this. <laughs> Ooh, nice, much better. Fifteen offense. Perfect. <laughs> Rebellion. Sounds close. What it could be? And there's another thing over there. Aha! Uh -huh. Something like very far up ahead. Lock. Yeah, so many locks. Revelio. So how would you like to do this? Uh <laughs> Weasley told me you had a list of things to get. A wand and some other bits. Dittany seeds, some spell crafts, and some potion recipes. Perfect. Can't wait to see what you do with the new wand. And a short list gives you plenty of time to poke around the village. I just have to pop into a shop to find something for my sister. Let's meet up in the town circle when you're finished. Yes. Remember, have fun. It's Hogsmeade. Ah, come on. Okay, uh drop some points of interest. Okay. Uh ah. Okay. I wanna head there or something, I don't know. Rebellion. All right, so it's just that. Ah. <laughs> Don't mind if I do. Can I get better neckwear? Seriously? It's high rarity, so. I'll be right with. Ah, it's you. Um, just a moment, please. Ah, mm. hello, sir. I'm looking for for a new wand. Yes, it's about time. Yes, uh, about time. Well, you're our new fifth-year student, are you not? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you are. Gerbold Olivander's the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivanders, I'm sure. Finest wand makers in the world. It's a pleasure to meet you, truly. Now, come with me. Let's find you the perfect one, shall we? Mm, uh, no, 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 not you. Um, ah, yes, yes. Mm, powerful core, ten and a half inches. Mm, you might do. 
Here, give this one a try. Well, go ahead, swish. Hmm, how odd. Uh, once more, come on, really swish it. Oh. oh dear. Fireworks! Well, this isn't a good match at all, is it? <laughs> uh, um, we'll find you something, not to worry. Mm. No, not you. Uh, uh, hmm. Perhaps. Yes. A rare wood, 13 and 3 quarter inches, dragon heart string. Let's give this one a try. like it's back to the shelf for you. Uh, this is proving to be trickier than I had yeah. anticipated. How perplexing. Um, where are you? Perhaps you? Uh, ah, there you are. <laughs> yes. <laughs> well, green boxes. I think you might be the one. Here. Take it. There we go. Okay. Elder. Curious indeed. Okay. Homebound. Ray. How intriguing. Oh, How intriguing. What? Flexibility. Curious indeed. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, let's see. Uh, okay, consistent. Okay. Great range, consistent, powerful. A dragon heartstring wand is most powerful and learns quickly. Is ah, over there? Phoenix feather, exceptionally rare, and a core with a strong sense of initiative. Okay, just not gonna say anything about that. Apparently, all right. What do you think? Another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> ah. Now, how did that feel? Good. Different. I sensed a sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you, just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. I would imagine so. A wand with a dragon heartstring core is capable of dazzling magic. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not be surprised at your new wand's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. <clears throat> Revelio. Okay, can you teach me <laughs> um, things? Oh, 
here. Us. Revelio. Aha. Gimme. Okay, I understand what that means now. Is it in this building? Maybe in here somewhere? Rebellion. Aha! Uh -huh. Oh. Sounds like it's in here. Ah! <laughs> Look at all these collectibles already, so... Let's be level up! And now! 25 HP! Perfect! I get away this. Seven more offense. Perfect! Revelio. And that next one's not in here. What was that? Oh! Ah! Yeah! Accurate. Yeah! Rebellion! Chest. Oh, it's in there. Or not. Darn it. Rebellion. It's one of those types of things. I wonder how it is in there. Where's that? That's we inside this building, right? I think so. Welcome to J. Pippin's Pushins. I wonder if I should take that, right? <laughs> Ooh, better rarity. And level as well. Oh yeah, starting a bunch stronger. Bunch strong, what, whatever. Do I need to be here? Oh uh, no, I don't. Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though... I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's Potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the most fascinating art potion making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always mm. said. Are potions really that versatile? They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses. And 
I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? Ah, I was about to What can this. I do for you today? Recipe for healing potion. Feel free to take Protect. a look at the rest of my inventory. Or come back another time if you're in a rush today. Focus recipe potion. Uh, visibility potion. I never have enough money at all. Okay. Uh, what's this one? I've been finding these. Ah, visibility potion. Okay, I don't need those then. I got this one. Focus potion. Oh, yeah, wait, hang on. Potion invisibility, uh, invincibility. here. I hope you have an amazing day. I'll see y'all in the next room.